after the recent change from BST to UTC here in the UK, I'm seeing a few posts on the on the group about setting or updating the times in the infotainment system on a Nissan Leaf. My Nissan Leaf is a Tecna 2021, so it may or may not be the same for other versions of the Leaf. But I'll go ahead anyway. So all we need is go into settings, go to menu, and then we scroll, keep scrolling until we get to the clock, tap the clock, and then we have uh, the settings on how to set this up. So we can see on here we've got on-screen clock, on or off, clock mode, clock format. We'll get to clock mode and clock format in a minute. Date format. Uh, you've got offset hours here that you might want to set manually. There are some uh, places in the world that have got half an hour time zones. Uh, Newfoundland, I believe, is one. But anyway, that's not a problem here in the UK. Uh, scroll down. And if we go right to the bottom, there are currently three items which are not accessible. All right. And this is because at the moment, here it's at the top, the clock mode is on auto. Now, what I believe this to be is that as long as the GPS system is working fine and it's giving you a correct position, it will work out what to do with the clock based on your GPS location. So obviously, if it thinks you're in the UK, it's going to set the clock accordingly. And they've got all sorts of uh, algorithms for working out um, daylight savings time and all that sort of stuff. So on auto, if your GPS is working, the clock will work fine. If your GPS is not working fine and you have to set it up uh, manually, you can set it up so that you can use... A specific time zone and if we scroll down now we can see that my current time zone is London but if we click that and I'm actually say in Europe somewhere and I want to be in Paris then you can see that the time is updated by an hour because Europe is an hour ahead put it back to London and it's at 8:42. Right, so if I put it on something really silly, let's put it on, um, I think, the Saskatchewan, right? So at the moment, it says 2.42, right? Because that's what the time is in Saskatchewan. But if I go back out one level and I go up to clock mode and I select auto, it completely ignores this time zone here, Saskatchewan, and it's actually put the time at 8.43. Okay, but we're, we're in time zone, so pick your right time, scroll down, something that's appropriate, there we go, London again, and if um, I need to change to summertime, just click that on, and it's gone an hour ahead, but obviously it's uh, UTC at the moment, so we'll turn that off. And it's gone to 8.43. And that's how you set up the clock. Now, there is a third option. Clock mode manual. So now you can set the clock manually. And you've obviously got options here for setting everything up. But that is, I'm not sure how that would work in the long term, but it is an option. Right, let's go back and I'm gonna, since my GPS is working fine, I'm gonna put it back on auto and the time has gone back to the correct time. 